Hello movie lovers, Bob for Bob's movie review here, and today I'm going to review for you a movie I just watched called Lady of the Manor. This one was sent to me for review by Lionsgate. If you get a chance to check this one out, let me know your thoughts down in the comment section below. I will include more information with the links, per one, down in the description. So first off, I love the cast, uh, Judy Greer, um, and Justin Long, Ryan Phillippe, Melanie Linsky. I, I don't know that I'm necessarily a fan of hers, but she's a star of the movie, I believe. I believe that's her name. And so just for bringing Justin Long and Ryan Phillippe into a movie, I gotta love it for that. But this movie is about this woman who she, she's a modern woman who, you know, isn't real proper and swears and is interested in sex and drugs and, you know, just kind of... I don't know. <laughs> I think really just a an exaggerated version of what Hollywood thinks people are like. I don't know, maybe they are, but not in my experience. People aren't really like they are portrayed in movies. And she ends up getting hired on at this kind of old house and they do tours and she's supposed to pretend to be this lady who used to own the house but died in the 1800s. And she doesn't do a real good job and, and the guy who owns the place really just wants to sleep with her and so that's kind of uh, why he hired her I guess and and why he keeps her there and then the ghost of the real lady uh, comes and tries to teach her to be proper and basically then there's kind of this mystery she ends up needing to solve about um, the rightful owners of the home and I didn't find this movie to be overly funny there I laughed a couple times I just I don't know. The jokes weren't for me. Um, but I did like the story. Like, I like the story. I thought it was a, you know, a fun story. Kind of a cute story, but not overly cute. And, uh, of course, it did have Justin Long. Had that going for it. So this movie was alright. Like I said, I just, I just didn't find the humor to be um, that funny uh, for me personally. So I give this one a 3 out of 5. Hope you did enjoy the video. If you haven't already, subscribe for more videos. Check out the videos. And I'll see you guys next time.